You know, there's a time in every guy's life mm -hmm. where he wonders, is that dude my best friend? Aww. Oh, really? You guys think that? <laughs> Maybe he is. Yeah. That's so sweet. What do I do now? Oh, just be friends. Well, it can get especially awkward as an adult if you get that feeling and you want to make it official by asking him to be your best bro. Oh. <laughs> Okay. That's uh -huh. what happens today. It's a big deal for oh, it does. Us. It doesn't happen all the time in dude circles. No, it's no. happening today okay. when Jose calls up a guy's girlfriend to say, "You might not know me, but I work with your man. Oh, and I think we're about to be bros for life. Oh, do you think he'll accept if I ask him? Oh, he's nervous. Get, getting some advice. No, he wants permission <laughs> yeah, oh, to be permission. best bros. Okay. So it's gonna get awkward in your phone tap right now. Hello. Hi, is this Sarah? Uh, yes. Who's <laughs> calling? Hi, my name is Eddie. We've never met before, but I am a huge fan. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry, I don't know you. I, I'm sorry, that sounded kind of weird. Um, look, I work with your boyfriend, Tim. I, I don't know if oh. he's ever mentioned anything about me. Maybe? Uh, oh, I'm sorry. No. But... Oh, okay, um... Are, are you sure, though? Maybe he called me Steady Eddie? Mm, or Eddie? No. Or Ed? Um. Ed? Edward, maybe? Like, you ever heard that name? No, I'm sorry. Oh. But are you okay? Is Tim okay? Yeah, Tim is great. Oh, my gosh. Tim, oh. He's amazing. I uh, Look, I, I just started working here a few weeks ago, and it's weird because, you know, him and I just, like, totally connected. Um connected how what are you talking about you know you know tim he's so funny and he thinks i'm funny i don't know it just you know it just kind of works between us it's like a like a brotopia okay <laughs> brotopia well, get it that's great you guys are friends yeah it is great and look this may sound a little cheesy but you know how every guy has a best bro yeah. Well, I think I finally found mine after all these years, and I am just so happy. <laughs> uh, okay. Do you um, think if I asked him to be my best bro, he would say yes? Do I think if I... Uh... Sir, I don't know. I'm sorry. Oh, my um, gosh. I don't know either. We're both nervous about this. Oh I, I'd be so happy. I, I'd do like a, like a cartwheel on a big grass hill, and I'd put it on YouTube, and I, I would title it Bros for Life, oh. <laughs> but like the number four because it's cooler. Uh, okay. okay. I should probably talk to Tim about this. Cause, um... Oh, no, no, don't don't tell him, okay? Don't tell him, it's a surprise. Don't tell him. Look, I just have two questions for you. First, when is his birthday? He will not tell me, that silly pants. <laughs> I keep um, asking. You sound like a nice guy, but... I am. <laughs> I'm uh, super nice. I, know, I don't know if I should get that information out, because he doesn't even know I'm talking to you, so... Oh, okay, forget that one. What about this one? This is more important. It, where is he most tinklish? Oh. <laughs> what? Uh, that's not I, funny. I got, I got long fingies, so if he wanted to be tickled anywhere, I need to know his sweet spot. You no, know, I, I got to get going, okay? No, wait, hold on, wait. He told me you guys were having an anniversary coming up, and you're going to like a, like a cabin. He told you that? Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to tag along, uh -huh. if that's okay. No. Yeah. I, no, I don't. Uh, because even though he's going to be getting down and dirty with you, he'll need some bro time to recharge the batteries, <laughs> if you know what I mean. <laughs> no, I don't know what you mean. <laughs> so if I'm doing bro time with him, we need to make sure that you have our lunches ready when we come back from fishing and arm wrestling each other. <laughs> I'm not making anybody lunches on oh. my anniversary. I don't even know who you are. I'm Steady Eddie. Yeah, you said that already, but I don't think he would appreciate you calling me without oh. asking him. No, he, he totally knows. He's the one who set you up for this prank phone call. It's like, it's like duh, and that's what bros do. Best bros. <laughs> wait, what? Yeah, my name's actually Jose from... Oh, wait, sorry. <clears throat> my name's actually Jose from the radio show Brooke and Jeffrey in the morning. We're doing a phone tap on you. <laughs> oh, my God. I'm like, what the hell is going on? Oh, my God. Yeah. I'm like, you're about to get cursed out, for real. I was trying to be nice. 
Because you said you was a co-worker. Oh, my God. <laughs> Look, Tim <laughs> set you up, and he obviously got you really good. He wanted to wish you a happy anniversary, tell you that he loves <laughs> you, you're his best friend in the world, and he's glad you're not his bro. Not like me. I'm his bro. Your voice is horrible. I hate your voice. <laughs> oh, you don't like my voice? Well, you better get used to it, sister, because you're going to hear a lot of it at the cabin when we're fishing and arm wrestling and you're making lunches. <laughs> yeah, I doubt it. I'll drown you first. Um, can I request no PB&Js because I'm allergic to peanuts? Sure. And, and also about 14 other things. Oh, my God. <laughs>